Hi, this is Bob with Gibbs RV, and today we're looking at a 2011 Montana Mountaineer Model 290 fifth wheel. Three slide fifth wheel, rear living edition. You can see two of the slides here on this side. We got a fiberglass nose cap here on the fr front that also incorporates a couple of neat things. First off, it has a mirror built right in for ease of docking with LCD lights so you can see what you're doing in the evening, but we also have max turn technology. The cutout of this front end allows you to tow keeping the RV further away from the cab of your truck, which in turn allows for sharper turning. On the outside here, um, now this little remote that I have in my hand here, this will actually operate most of these features I need to do to set up this RV. I can operate the stabilizer jacks, the landing gear, the security light, the slide outs, the awning, pretty much a one man show right here in the palm of my hand. A couple of the nice things about these, this is new and improved, the graphics resistant to solar fading and a lot brighter, more brilliant colors as well. The door, you see it's a radial entry door, but it has this elongated frosted window that diffuses the light, lets a uh, brighter interior into the coach, more sunlight in the coach. Aluminum wheels, uh, total surround aluminum. They are aluminum superstructure, but a lot of RVs just put the aluminum on the sides. Here you have it in the sides, back, roof, front, as well as steel support in the roof. It's not heavier, it's actually lighter. Outside speakers, your big awning, and the compartment here allows you to hook the TV up remotely, watch the Super Bowl, your favorite ball game under your awning with outside speakers right in front of your new RV. This is a rear living model, so you see we got the big picture window here in the back, lets a lot of light in, nice view, nice crowned roof, keeps that rainwater running off, roof rack, ladder assembly, and rear bumper. Here's the super slide, you can see from the back side here, and the bedroom slide up toward the front. Tinted glass all the way around, uh, your compartments here, very easy to operate. Open up inside. See this particular one there is on the other side. That's where you can place your television and the articulating arm you can hook up to and a TV jack as well. You can also see this aluminum structure in here. See just how this trailer's made. So much for the outside. Let's go ahead and take a look at the inside. This is a three slider, so you got a lot of room in this RV for its size. When you step inside, first thing you're going to notice, right across from us, there's the super slide, which houses the sofa bed and the dinette. But just look at the cupboards lining the top of that super slide. All kinds of storage. Wood trim, wood trim rather, on the facing of the slide out. Now when I came in here too, something really handy to have is a coat rack. Well, they have one, but they put doors on it. So that coat, whatever garments you hang, aren't in the way. Control panel and up above storage as well. Very high quality cabinets, by the way. We have an entertainment area here with AM, FM, CD, DVD, Jensen, resistant to moisture, used in marine and RV application. Sony LCD TV, frosted glass windows above, and wood cabinets below for your media storage. In the back, there's that big window we talked about, but just look at all the windows. There's one, two, three in the back, one, two, three, four in the slide out. So really lets the light inside. The kitchen, neat setup. You got the island peninsula here coming out with all this counter space. Gooseneck fountain, flush mounted sink with, composite sink with, cutting board cupboards and they even um, cut out here kind of neat when you're walking around this you don't want to bump your hip and spill boiling water so that's kind of a, a neat design three burner stove oven below microwave oven above nor cold refrigerator freezer with real wood fascia um, cabinet storage here for pantry and you can see really a nice setup where the chairs sit here including the dinette and even the sofa the TV is easily viewed from just about anywhere in this coach. Also have ceiling fan, speakers incorporated throughout the coach. As we go up to the front, a couple of steps up. You see we have a glass shower enclosure on our left. Queen size bed and headboard built right into the slide out. A window on each side with curtains for privacy. 
as well as reading light posted inside too. So you can, uh, if you want to read in bed, well, that's your option. It's a two-piece shower. Makes it a little bigger that way instead of the one pieces with skylight overhead. Works in a lot of light. Speakers continue throughout the bedroom as well as another television, Jensen LCD TV, sink, vanity, built-in dresser, additional wardrobe storage right here as well as plumbing for a wash machine if you wish to have one installed and mirrored closet doors now some of them will boast not keystone but other brands will boast walk-in closet basically it just comes out another foot far from walk-in well you take a foot away from your bedroom it's really going to limit you so here we have single rod with a shoe rack carpeted inside plenty of room for lots of clothing so here it is, a three-slide 2011 Mountaineer right here at Gibbs RV in Coos Bay. We take trades, we finance, and we can even arrange delivery for you. So give us a call at 1-800-824-4388. That's Gibbs RV in Coos Bay.